Good morning, Lincoln family. This is Jasmine Roshan welcoming to you with the Lincoln student address for the week of November 16th. First and foremost, all New York City schools will be fully remote starting on Thursday, November 19th. Lincoln is already remote every Wednesdays and Fridays, so keep an eye out for the news updates about when we'll be back in person. As always, we thank you for your attendance each day. 2020 continues to be a reminder for us that working together is our only hope. I know online school can be stressful, and especially those times when we're like bombarded with assignments, but it's important to remember not to get burned out. So I advise you all, it doesn't matter if you're a teacher or a student or a staff, to take some time out of your day and do something for yourself. You can do a simple form of self-care, such as like going on a walk or like reading a book or trying a new recipe. Because those simple little things, over time, they add up to big results and have a great impact on your mental and your physical health. Attention all students, this November we are collecting canned foods and other non-perishable items to be donated to our families who are experiencing food insecurity in our local community. So if you would like to donate, please drop off your items at the scanning, the main lobby, or at room 236 from periods 1 through 3. Want to help but can't make it to school? Well, this year you may donate using our online store at alhs.nyc and select clicking school store and selecting food drive donations. We thank you all for your donations. Are you feeling like falling behind work or need help? Well, reach out to your teachers through Microsoft Teams. You can find your teachers by entering their last name in the new chat. They'd all love to hear from you and they're always here for you. Also, we're planning on meeting for clubs on Microsoft Teams. Thank you for participating and let's stay connected through social distancing. Remember, in Lincoln, everyone has at least three somebodies. So if you need help, please reach out to your teachers, guidance counselors, social workers, academic team leaders, or assistant principals, or even just to say hi. And in closing, this was Jasmina Roshanova. See you soon, Lincoln family. And remember to be kind to one another. Welcome back to the Bumps of the Week. This is the third Bump of the Week. Tell me your favorite from the last ones, last favorite songs from the last couple Bumps of the Week. Put in the comments. And if you got a song that you feel like I'm sleeping on, definitely put it in the comments. I'll definitely listen and consider it for the next Bump of the Week. All right. So this week, number one, you got Chef G turn the lights on. Y'all kind of had to know this was going to happen. Flatbush legend, Brooklyn legend, don't miss. Turn the lights on is... It's different. Turn the lights on. Great song. It could they could have been a longer verse in there, but the song the song is pretty good. The next song I hear is G Herbo, featuring Lil Durk, Gangsta Party. Gangsta Party is a vibe, man. You just chilling, doing whatever you gotta do. Lil Vert come. With, I said Lil Vert. Lil Durk comes with a nice little verse, and he really delivers on that track. It's one fifty plus one fifty. It's three hundred. Ain't no difference. Like. That's a bar. If you know, if you know who, Lil Durk, you know G Herbo. That's a bar. Feel me? Third song of this track is Future and Lil Uzi Vert, Rockstar Chain. Now I did not really care for the album. Not gonna lie, the album wasn't really for me. But Rockstar Chains is it. Rockstar Chains definitely was it. Go check that out. The next song on here is Kev Play No Games. My son Kev got a couple songs he been working on, and the songs is pretty good. They're pretty top quality. Feel me? They're pretty top quality. Yes. The songs are good. The song kind of have a, a little flow switch on it here and there. It's a nice song. Number five, I got HLS Cole and HLS Side on Boost. Boost, if if you know who those people are, you know we've been waiting for Boost for a while. And Boost did not disappoint. Boost was definitely it. Number six, I got Rod Wave all week. Y'all know how much I like Rod Wave. Rod Wave is that is that boy, especially especially when it comes to singing, he's that boy. Rod Wave all week is pretty catchy of a song, just like most of his songs. But this this song is pretty catchy too. I need to check that out for real. Number seven, I got Daniel Lost Souls. Now that song is a good song. I wouldn't say just listen to it randomly, but if you're in like a chilling mood, that's definitely the song to go to. Lost Souls, Daniel. Especially if you love somebody, he's kind of talking to you. And that song really worked out, feel me? 
that is the bumps of week three. Let me know your favorite bump in the comment. And let me know what I'm sleeping on. Why y'all not putting me on? Let me know what I'm sleeping on. Hit that like button. Do all that good stuff.